Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm your trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of Euro USD. So, if you're watching my videos for the first time, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular market analysis. And do not forget to check out the Forex analysis playlist on my channel for the analysis of other pairs. So, let's get started. So, this is the 4 hour chart of Euro USD in front of us right now. If you have watched my previous video, then I would like to tell you that things have not changed much in the chart of euro usd as we can clearly see on the chart that still euro usd is trading in this downward narrow channel and as expected there is not much volatility in the market so if you are watching my videos for the first time then let me tell you that okay we have got three important levels here okay you can see that i have got three lines over here okay the most important level in the chart of euro usd is this level 1.1712 this is the most crucial level for the market right now because this support level belongs to the weekly chart if you go to the weekly chart here and after removing the drawings you can clearly see that right now market is just standing above the weekly support and we can see that previously in the month of March, when market was in market was facing selling pressure, this was the level that provided support to the market. And right now we can see that though market was in was under the influence of sellers, but right after reaching this particular level, somehow things became stagnant, which means that right now market is gathering strength. Okay, try to understand the market psychology here. Market was in downtrend, but near this support level, market is not. Rather, market is showing that there is not much volatility in the market. But right now, market is gathering strength. So, if we look at the weekly chart here, then there is a good possibility that market will bounce from this particular level. Right now, if we look at the four hours chart. market may seem in downtrend but the weekly chart is clearly giving us a signal that that there is a good possibility that euro usd will bounce from this particular level just try to understand the market psychology here if this market okay if this market would have been under heavy influence or heavy dominance of sellers then we would have seen some something not like this okay we would have seen something big red candles but right now you can clearly see that no market is trading in a downward channel here but at this particular portion of the chart okay market is flat which means market is gathering strength so there is a good possibility that market will be bouncing from this level and right now okay right now market is trading here and i will not recommend a sell here or I will not recommend a buy at this trend line. I will just recommend you to wait for the perfect opportunity or wait for the market to come down to the support level. And if we go to the currency strength meter here, okay, this is the currency strength meter, and I'm in the daily time frame. Hmm. What happened? <laughs> okay. So so this is the currency strength meter and i'm in a daily time frame you can see that euro and this is the euro and this is the us dollar you can see that the strength of both the currencies are almost equal and as i have clearly spoken in my earlier videos that whenever you'll get a scenario like this whenever you will see two currencies of almost of the equal strength then you will get a sideways market when you see a when you'll see one currency very strong and another currency very weak then you'll get a trending market but in a scenario like this where two currency currencies are almost of the equal strength you will get a sideways market and we can clearly see that euro usd is in sideways right now it may be trading or traveling in downward channel but right now market does not does not showing any serious selling pressure here and if we go to forex sentiment meter here you'll find the forex sentiment meter on my website avilashazarika.com okay, under the forex sentiment meter you can see that 
34% retail traders have taken short position and 65% retail traders have taken long position see i'm also i'm also saying the same thing that you should take the long position or you should also go for buying position but what i'm saying is that you should buy at the support level you should buy at the weekly support level if it bounces but these retail traders have already taken buying position so they are just going opposite of the direction i'm told i'm telling you to go for buy direction when there will be a trend reversal but still there is not a trend reversal we do not have a trend reversal right now but they have already taken the buying position and this is the main reason 90 percent retail traders lose money therefore my dear friends do not follow do not follow the retail traders they have taken long position already taken over that's a wrong thing to do you should only go for buy at the weekly support level otherwise market is still trading in a downward channel here keep in mind and if we go to the forex volatility calculator here you can see that euro usd is not having much movement here in five minutes chart you can see that hardly there is a movement of 3.5 pips in the 30 minutes chart there is hardly a movement of 7.6 pips in the four hour chart only 32 pips movement and in the daily chart only 54 pips movement so there is not much volatility in the market also and as we all know if there is no volatility in the market then we cannot make money therefore we can hope that volatility will volatility will come to the market okay once euro usd will touch the weekly support and bounce so what should be your strategy then your strategy is simple okay right now market is just trading here to do not short the market also because you can clearly see that there is no volatility in the market so wait for the market to come down to the support level 1.1712 level when market will hit this level just observe the price just see how the price is doing or how the price is reacting if you see price bouncing from this level then you'll get the confirmation that yes Savilash was telling the right thing market has taken support at the weekly level and it is about to bounce and you can easily go for buy here but right now there is no use of trading in this market because market is dull here okay so wait for the market to come down to this level then only you'll get a better opportunity ah, so this is it hopefully you have understood if you have liked the video and found the video informative give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis thank you so much all the best take care see you tomorrow